Is there anything wrong with suggesting certain supports given to refugees should also be available to the Irish? And also, is there is it discriminatory to turn around and say, you know, we should look after the Irish first? I know it's a bit Donald Trumpish, isn't it? The government have allowed a system arise where there's absolutely no controls, there's no checks, it's a chaotic system, and as a result, they've sent a message out to the world that Ireland is a soft touch. How is it empathetic if, if your actions are making life insufferable and dangerous for everyone else? Like, what about the government's empathy towards the Irish homeless, or those on the hospital waiting list, or the staff in those sectors who are already overworked? The people who call you racist are the very ones who don't have to deal with the problems that these people are bringing with them. The records at every level, as we know, have been broken on child homelessness, child abuse, adult homelessness, couch surfers, housing. One million people now on hospital waiting list. Anyone who sticks their head into the noose or rises to that pulpit, they are shot down with this far-right speech and rhetoric. And, and once again, using the key statement of your show today, is it that wrong? Is it so wrong that Irish people want to fight for their own history, heritage, culture and tradition? You're a racist. You are now far-right. You are now, I suppose, borderline terrorist in your own country.